moves forward and we're just about ready to go now on the Luskin Star Stakes. There's the light. Stand by for a break. Ready? And they're racing. Steely taken back and Tamer Lane jumped well together with Marin Par. Now much, much better. Being wound up on the outside. And much, much better. The Grey showing great speed and it's going to burn across and lead comfortably from Tamer Lane. Nemeth there. Marin Par there off the course. Followed by Coast Watch, Kalino and Kobe. Three out into the bend. Uh, Fender's in a three-wire position with a back to follow on the outside of Amenabola. Over on the inside, Gravina, a length and a half, rocketing by then Kinlock. King of the Castle pulling back in the field. Now, Jimmy Starr, the other favourite, is third last on the rails. From Key Largo and two lengths to Steely. Much, much better. Loves to run in the lead. Shows out by a half to Marin Par. Tamer Lane leaders back third as they come around the corner, followed by Nemeth. Kobe off the course. Further back to Coast Watch, Kalino between runners. Then came Fender getting to the outside, and Amenable will be riding for luck in the center of the field. Much, much better at the 300. Coast Watch goes up the inside from Tamer Lane. Kobe running on. Fender to the outside. Going back towards the inside, Amenable and Gravina. But Coast Watch races a length and a half clear with 100 meters to go. Coast Watch in front from Kobe the outside. Amenable's flashing home. Coming fast. Coast Watch in front will hang on just. Just Coast Watch a half head to Amenable who absolutely flew home. I think Gravina third on the inside of Kyobi. Further back then to Jimmy Starr flashing home at the end. From Key Largo, Kalino, King of the Castle, Steely. Uh, then came Fender, Nemeth, Marin Parr. Much, much better got tired. Oh, this is a lot closer than the great D Flindell maybe has given off at the end there. What are your thoughts? I reckon Amenable might have put in the ultimate dive there over the top of Coast Watch. Uh, I think I mean, oh. gut feel is Coast Watch did all, all the work. He's home here. Richard and Will Freeman looking for a double today. Regan Bayless goes for home on uh, Coast Watch. And just when you think he is 100% home, then up on the inside comes Amenable with a big way to make it close. But you sh I'm convinced that he hasn't been able to get there. He hasn't. Well done. They purchased him in May 2022 for $500,000. The son of Fast Net Rock out of Bullion Mansion. So that is uh, uh, a family of the mighty Redoute's choice there. And uh, they have done a good job with him. They get a big win. So they've got a state-to-state -state Metro double today, having trained a winner here. So... That is good for the team in Richard and Will. Good job to you boys, Regan Bayless. Great job steering Coast Watch to victory. Amenable, look, he was absolutely Huge. gallant in defeat with the big weight. Gravina, Matty Dale, the ex Godolphin Galloper on the fence for third. And then Kaiobi flashing home late on the outside, number 17, to fix up the multiples. We are just about ready for the Doombin 10,000, our big group one of the day.